Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Grumman Pilot's YouTube channel. And this morning, we're going to be talking about the TCDS, or our Type Certificate Data Sheet. And this is really just a formal declaration of the limitations of the engine, the aircraft, or the propeller. And we're going to be looking specifically right now at the one for the airframe. Now, this is the Type Certificate Data Sheet for the two-seaters, the Grumman Yankee, the 1A, the 1B, and the 1C. And this covers everything. And the first part of it here tells you who it's by, who the current owner is. And you can see in the listing that it was the American Aviation Corporation, that it was transferred to Grumman American, and then from Grumman American to Gulfstream American on down the line. And so here we have at the very bottom of the first page what the engine is, even what carburetor settings were allowed to have, the fuel, and then the engine limitation for all operations, 2600 RPM, and that's 108 horsepower, and then a bit of information on what the prop is allowed to have. So that's just page one. There are eight pages in total, including control surface limitations and such. I won't bore you with reading them, but they are available. And now we're going to move on to a particular case where having the type certificate data for the engine came in really handy during an annual. Stand by. And now let's look at the type certificate for the Lycoming 0235 series of engines. And on the first page, we have all the different variants, but you'll see they all share, share things like the stroke and the bore, the displacement, and things like that. But for the different variants, they'll have different carburetor settings, different magneto settings, and that's what we're going to be verifying here, is what magnetos do we have on the L2C for one we just had come in for annual. Now we're going to go through the type certificate on the engine fairly quickly and we're going to find ourselves fairly rapidly on the last page. And that's where it tells us for the, each of the engine variations what we can have for a magneto. And we've zoomed in here so we slide down till we get to the L2C and we see that we can have a slick 4250, 4252, or a 4250 and a 4281 or two 4252s are two 4281s, which, by the way, we had two 4383s on the aircraft, so they are legal magnetos for the L2C variant of the O235. So we hope you found this explanation of the type certificate data sheet useful and informative, and using it to actually look something up that you'll find useful to see if your airplane is really legal, which is what the FAA is worried about on paper, more than mechanically. So thanks for watching our video, and have a good day flying your Grumman.